I'm going to show you how to build a complete website in about two minutes. Not a template, not a basic landing page, a complete website with professional header and footer, responsive design that works on all devices, terms of service page, policy page, and an SEO optimized blog. Plus, it's going to deploy live on the web with your own URL. Now, agencies will scope out this work and they're going to charge you thousands of dollars. But here's what's crazy. In 2025, you're still paying fees for basic websites. You're still waiting on developers and still locked into platforms that own your code. What if I told you you could launch a professional website today, pay $0 in hosting fees, own 100% of the code, and never worry about renewals or subscriptions again. Stay until the end, and I'm going to show you exactly how gitpage.site makes this possible in around two minutes. This isn't just an AI agent website builder. It's about taking back control of your online presence. Let me show you how. First, head to gitpage.site. Once you're signed up, you can start building. If you need a refresher on how any of it works, there is a bit of an infographic here that runs through how, how this is going to go. But we're just going to go to start building. Now, at this point, I will mention there are two methods to generate the website, the in-app form and also an external link method, which you do not need to be logged in to do. And it's somewhat genius. I'll do that one next. For this first one, we're going to do a site called Texas Web Design. I'm going to fill in all this information here and then we'll watch it get built. All right, we submit it and let it do its thing. So the site's been generated, you get redirected to your Git page sites page, and then you just click view site. And here we go, best websites in Texas. And then if we scroll down, we can take a bit of a look. Now, what you're going to notice here is this looks pretty thin on the ground. There's not a lot here. And the reason for that is it is just completed and deployed the second iteration. And if we wait about 30 seconds and do a refresh, we're going to get the improved version. So it iterates, it checks its own work, and then it comes up with the final product. About 20 seconds later, we have the final cut. Scroll down a little bit. We've got enterprise grade features. So we've got our custom design, premium hosting, fixed pricing, the benefits of using TWD, Texas Web Design, high conversion rates, SEO performance, sub two second load times. And then this is where it's really interesting. The AI knows that we're building an agency in Texas. It's come up with the client success stories for cities around that area. It goes beyond just sort of creating the copy. It's actually taking into consideration the entire requirements and you know logically drafting the copy around that. Next, We've got the about section and then we've got frequently asked questions and then there's a call to action start your digital journey so this would link off to the call to action button you could have this going to a jot form a type form for someone to fill out the the request to be contacted etc now further down we do have our quick links which all work features we've got the about section the faq contacts right down the bottom so you can see it's a fully working menu structure also we have the privacy policy we'll go back we have the terms of service and we also have the blog. You can scroll through this. This gives the website a bit of SEO juice to kick things off with. This site is live on the web right now. So this is Typeform. If you've not used it before, it's really cool. It allows you to build forms and you can do it for free. Now here is the form that I've developed. It's quite basic. It asks very similar questions to the in-app form. It allows users who are not logged into Git page to submit their requirements. So the use case for this is if you're an agency and a client wants you to build them a website, you send them this link, they fill out the form. And before you've finished your cup of coffee, the actual website is already built. Let me show you. So I'm just quickly going to enter in the same information for Texas Web Design. Just 
and press submit. Alrighty, so our Typeform based website build is now complete. So if I just click on this, we can take a look. It's all here. We've got the, the features, we've got the advantages, we have our story, client success, frequently asked questions, and our call to action. And again, all of our quick links, our legals, our blog, contacts, and a fully working menu. How does all this happen? That's what I'm going to show you next. And also how to add a custom domain if you don't want to use the default. Just before we get to the next section, if you're interested in getting four and five star reviews for your business, boost your SEO traffic and also convert more visitors into customers, check out ninja200.online. I will leave a link in the description. It is my private community. It is capped at 200 members. If you're interested, check it out. Now let's get back to the video. If you get yourself a getpage.site account, one of the first things you need to do, and this is just a one off, is you head to the manage keys page here and you enter in your keys. Now type form is optional, but the two ones you do need is a GitHub API key or GitHub tokens and also a Claude or Anthropic API key. Now just click on get started and it takes you over to this page here, getting started with gitpage.site and it runs you through every single step. It's going to take you a couple of minutes and then you are good to go. So I'm here on github.com. If you've never used it, it's pretty easy to navigate and find your way around. It's totally free for the purpose of using it with gitpage.site. It hosts your code repository. It also hosts your website and you can also add a custom domain 100% free. What you're going to see when you come in and look at your files and just for reference, this is the exact website we just generated a couple of minutes ago. You're going to see these standard files. So read me the blog.html, index.html, privacy.html, and terms.html. With the readme file, basically it's going to tell you how to update any text. It's going to tell you if there's a broken link, what you need to do to fix it. If I click on one of these files, say index.html, it's got your menus, features, benefits, testimonials, etc. It's also got your headings. If you want to change any of this copy, you can do so super easy. You just click the little pencil icon, edit this file, make any changes you want. Put an S here just so it triggers, and then I can press commit changes and press save. That's it. In addition to having 100% free hosting, you can have your own custom domain associated with your gitpage.site website, and it's totally free as well. So to do that, just go into your repository where your code was, and you'll see the button up here, settings, then click on pages and then come down to here where it says custom domain. You'll have to purchase your domain, whatever your domain happens to be. Enter it in here like I have for ninja200.online. Click save and it will actually give you full instructions. But if you want to skip that and just know exactly what to do, go into your registrar, whoever you're registered with. Say I've got Namecheap here. Go into the advanced DNS and all you need to do is add these four records. Four A records, the host is at, and then these are the values. Once you have done that, click save. Sometimes it might take 10 minutes, other times it might take an hour. This will go from not verified to verified or check in progress. And up here you can tell that it's all working because it says your site is live at, and it gives you the custom domain. If you'd like to try out gitpage.site, there is no subscription. It's just a one-time payment and it allows you to get all future updates of the product. If you got some value from this video, it would be amazing if you'd give it a like and drop us a comment if you have any questions. If you'd like to know how to generate amazing SEO blogs and do keyword research with AI, check out this video here.